G'day marshmallows, my name is Oscar and this is the Coco Couch. Today we're going to be watching Return of the Jedi. I haven't seen it in a very long time. It is taking me quite some time to get through the Star Wars movies. Don't worry, we will get through them eventually. I'm not sure whether we'll get through the sequels. I want to do the prequels soon. So yeah, we'll see how this goes. So without further ado, let's jump into it. Uh, here we go, once again. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> Every single time there's a ship. <laughs> I feel like the uh, the stormtroopers have been preparing all for hours for the Sith's arrival. <laughs> yes, gotta be on our best behaviour for Lord Vader. That would be me too, honestly. I would not say a peep. I would just... Please don't choke me to death. <laughs> oh, look at those shiny boots. I assure you, Lord Vader, my men are working as fast as they can. But I'm sure I can find new ways to motivate them. The Emperor does not share your optimistic appraisal of the situation. I need more men. He is most displeased with your apparent lack of progress. We shall double our efforts. Oh, man. So this poor guy. Work. He's just trying to do his job. He even gave constructive sort of like an offer he was like please like i need more men and lord vader's just like nah just do better <laughs> wow. lando calrissian and poor chewbacca never returned from this awful place the things i've heard about this jab of the hut you'd probably short circuit i feel like c-3po is the type that would short circuit <laughs> hearing about some crime lord there doesn't seem to be anyone here let's go back and tell master luke <laughs> i love how quickly he gives up mishka jabba du hut <laughs> I don't think they're going to let us in, Artu. We'd better go. <laughs> Every single time, like, he just gives up so quickly. I love seeing these, like, these costumes. The makeup department did so well with these movies. We bring a message to your master, Jabba the Hutt. Hey, child, is so good. I really likes Artu. But our instructions are to give it only to... There it is again. I wonder how many different movies outside of the Star Wars saga they've used that quote. I have a bad feeling about this just because of these movies. But then again, I guess it's not really an uncommon sort of thing to say. <laughs> Greetings, exalted one. I know that you were powerful and that your anger with Solo must be equally powerful. He's saying all the right things to make Jabba at least respect him. As a token of my goodwill, I present to you a gift. These two droids. <laughs> what did he say? <laughs> he really stitched them up, didn't he? Oh, solo thought to market He's still frozen in carbonite. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> that little creature always laughing. It always, it's always so random. Did That's I something I did. Yeah. I never expressed any unhappiness with my work. Poor C-3PO. He doesn't realize he's a member of the gang. He's not just some protocol droid that they use. <laughs> so cruel. Is he being punished for something he said or did? This protocol droid might be useful. Take him back up to his excellency's main audience chamber. Don't leave me. <laughs> <laughs> the scene is so strange to me. Uh, and the added CGI chick. Oh, uh, here we go. See, the music's actually pretty fire, but... <laughs> It just makes me feel uncomfortable watching. This is easily one of those scenes that you watch for the first time and you're just like, what am I watching? <laughs> That's what happens when you disobey. The Great Jabba. That was a scream and a half right there. Great security. Anyone can just walk up in front of Jabba and shoot him. Bid you welcome and will gladly pay you the reward of 25,000. Oh wow, 50,000. <laughs> Imagine asking for double. Why he must pay 50,000? Because he's holding a thermal detonator. <laughs> <laughs> he's not scared at all. Gotta give it to Jabba. He's good at his job. Jabba offers a sum of 35. He agrees! Ah, oh, poor Chewie. 
Ah, Lando Calrissian. Great disguise. <laughs> So random. But I guess scene like even just insignificant scenes like that, like add to the I guess the scale of like the galaxy that this these movies take place in makes it feel more like lived in. <laughs> they think they're being so sneaky. This is when I was growing up and I'd go downstairs in the middle of the night to like cook some food in the microwave or get something out of the fridge. It's like trying to be so quiet. It's pretty good CGI, actually. You're free of the carbonite. Mate, I wonder what that feel like. I can't see. Your eyesight will return in time. Who are you? <laughs> Someone who loved you. Leia. Ah, so cute. <laughs> I know that laugh. <laughs> Surprise! <laughs> Happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> You're throwing away a fortune here. Don't be a fool. And is this all part of the plan? Is everything going to plan? I can't tell. You're going to regret this. Oh, all the snot and stuff coming out of his nose and mouth. Ugh. I can't bear to watch. Yeah, me neither. <laughs> it's the sky. <laughs> Luke. Luke's crazy. He can't even take care of himself. Much less <laughs> rescue anybody. Luke's pretty capable now, I'm assuming. Yo, go away, you rat. I must speak with Jabba. He's asleep. He's like, bro, he's asleep. Don't wake him up. He's gonna be mad at me. You will take me to Jabba now. Force can manipulate weak minds. <laughs> Master Luke, you're standing on. Ah, oh, that should have been enough of a hint. Come on, bro. <laughs> Dang, dude. Just tried to shoot him. Wakey, wakey. It's breakfast time. <laughs> yeah, that thing's out of there. Oh my gosh, all these mates are just like laughing at him and stuff. Like, are you serious? Mmm, delicious. Uh, yeah, yeah, bro, you gotta, you gotta figure something out. <laughs> it ain't a lightsaber, but it will do. Solid. Oh, that makes me cringe. It's like having a toothpick stuck in your mouth and then you just crunch down on it. Ugh. Dang, poor Jabba. He's probably like, there goes like 20 million credits. <laughs> it's so sad. I feel so sorry for him. It's so random though in this movie how they included that. Like just some mindless creature that was technically like the villain in that scene dying and then its owner being upset about it. Oh. Nesting place of the all-powerful Sarlacc. In his belly you will find a new definition of pain and suffering <laughs> as you are slowly digested over a thousand years. Unless of course you die from thirst first, right? Which would take like a week or two. I love how even when she's a prisoner, she's just like, excuse me? Like, <laughs> did you just tug on my chain? I used to live here, you know. You're gonna die here, you know. <laughs> Convenient. I love how he just keeps making jokes even when their situation is so, like, messed up. <laughs> like, they're gonna die. Jabba, this is your last chance. Free us or die. They're underestimating him. Someone has to be watching all this happening and being like, why why is he why is he looking around? What, what what's 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 about to happen? Shot. Let's go. <laughs> Come on, dude. Bro, he's not even deflecting them. He's just running past them. Bye, Bubba Fett. Until we see you in the TV show. <laughs> Far out. She's so brutal, but hey, she gets it done. Oh, mate. Ugh, it's so gross. 
He's just murdering people. <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. I can see a lot better. Come on, we gotta get out here. <laughs> Let's go. Wow, they only just got out though. Nice. Regardless of how convoluted that plan was, it worked. <laughs> That's right, R2. We're going to the Dagobah system. I wonder how much more training Luke had with Yoda between 5 and 6. Wow. That's an audience. I feel like that feels so empty, though, you know? Like, you've got this huge audience, but all of them are basically just slaves to you, right? I feel like the only reason you'd ever want an audience is for people like you respect. He's got no one there that respects him. And now I sense you wish to continue your search for young Skywalker. I want my son back. <laughs> Patience. He will see you and you must bring him before me. Only together can we turn him to the dark side. Everything is proceeding as I have foreseen. I guess uh he planned on having the first Death Star destroyed then. That face you make. Don't I so old to your eyes? No. Yes, I do. Yoda's like, don't lie to me. I look old. When 900 years old you reach, look as good you or not. Hmm? <laughs> no. I mean, he, he looks quite old when he's like 50. <laughs> Forever sleep. Where did I have? Master Yoda, you can't die. Has it got to do with his species that he lived that long? Or has it got to do with the Force as well? Then I am a Jedi. <laughs> you must confront Vader. So he's got all the skills and the knowledge. It's kind of like a final test, a rite of passage. Your father he is. Told you, did he? Unexpected this is. I believe when The Empire Strikes Back came out, the plot twist of Vader being his father was so big that people weren't sure whether it was actually true. So they had to confirm it in this scene. Anger. Fear, oppression, the dark side, will it dominate your destiny? Yeah. I bet most Jedi's back in the day didn't get a test as extreme as that, being tempted by the dark side. I feel like Luke's test of being tempted by the dark side is way more extreme than other Jedi's had to face. The last of the Jedi will you be. The Force runs all in your memory. There is Probably the longest time you'll take to say Skywalk. <laughs> and there he goes. The great Master Yoda. Mate, he lived quite a life, didn't he? Rest in peace, bro. He has joined Obi-Wan in the ghost realm, or whatever it is. You told me Vader betrayed and murdered my father. He ceased to be Anakin Skywalker and became Darth Vader. So what I told you was true. From a certain point of view. Certain point of view? <laughs> Literally everyone in the audience. Are you serious? <laughs> I took it upon myself to train him as a Jedi. I thought that I could instruct him just as well as Yoda. Mm. I was wrong. Well, clearly. I can't do it then. Luke's too optimistic. Your destiny. That is the reason why your sister remains safely anonymous. Maya. Anonymous? No more. <laughs> Bury your feelings deep down, Luke. Yes, bury those feelings, bro. <laughs> but they could be made to serve the Emperor. Nah, you, you know he didn't mean, like, any romantic feelings. It's because those feelings of love, whether, you know, family love, can be used to, against him later on. You, a general, huh? <laughs> Someone must have told him about my little maneuver at the Battle of Deneb. Well, don't look at me, pal. I want to see some of the battles that the, the rebels were in in between these movies. We've learned that the Emperor himself is personally overseeing the final stages of the construction of this Death Star. So I imagine it's very, very difficult to know exactly the location of 
Darth Sidious at any time, right? It is protected by an energy shield, which is generated from the nearby forest moon of Endor. The shield must be deactivated if any attack is to be attempted, while the fighters fly into the superstructure and attempt to knock out the main reactor. So I imagine once the Death Star was actually completed, it would be far more difficult to crack than the first Death Star, Death Star was. It's only while it's not fully built that it's vulnerable. A strike team will land on the moon and deactivate the shield generator. Mm. How dangerous. And who they found to pull that off? General Solo, is your strike team assembled? <laughs> She's like, what? Count me in. I'm with you too. <laughs> what a, what an entrance. <laughs> he loves announcing his presence. Uh, it's like a baby. Hey. Funny feeling, like if I can see her again. <laughs> I would love if Leia was just like really mad, like jealous. <laughs> Ten the feet to the far side of Endor. Then it was stay. What of the reports of the rebel fleet massing near Sullis? Soon the rebellion will be crushed and young Skywalker will be one of us. His arrogance could get the better of him, eh? If they don't go for this, we're gonna have to get out of here pretty quick, Chewie. Shuttle Tidarium requesting deactivation of the deflector shield. Shuttle Tidarium, what is your cargo and destination? Parts and technical crew for the forest moon. Leave them to me. As you wish, my lord. Carry on. That general seems like the kind of person Vader would like. <laughs> He's so straight to the point and so monotone. Follow your present course. Okay. I told you it was gonna work. No problem. I think even he was slightly surprised. Whoa, you can see all the like the different levels in the Death Star from the outside. That's so cool. Uh, I told you it was dangerous here. <laughs> They're being so careful, like with the camo. And like being absolutely silent, and you just got this gold flipping robot just walking around going, Oh goodness me! <laughs> What's the point of all their secrecy and stealth? This whole party will be for nothing if they see us. Julie and I'll take care of this. You stay here quietly. It's me. <laughs> <laughs> that look, that's what I'm worried about. <laughs> oh my goodness. What a reflex, though. Just backhanded him. Mate. Hey, wait! Nah, they can't wait, dude. Can't let the others escape. <laughs> Regardless of what he's done in his life, I don't think he deserved that. <laughs> Ah, oh, more. Come on. Oh, she just decided to go up. Dang, he's going so fast. Whoa, alright. Did she just go up into the trees? Yikes. Uh, that was lucky. Yeah, come on, you're a Jedi, you got this. This is easy. Light work. Come on. It'd be so cool though if like he was gonna come past him and he literally just like force chokes him. <laughs> like just stops mid-flight. I'm gonna have some popcorn. Oh. Mate, he ran back all that way. Luke! Where's Leia? What, she didn't come back? I thought she was with you. Cut it out. <laughs> I love how Leia is in the middle of nowhere and she knows that the place is occupied by em the Empire and she's just like, cut it out, the first thing she says. <laughs> Want something to eat? <laughs> That's all it took. Food. I trust you now. What is it? <laughs> <laughs> Dang. There's a sniper. Freeze! <gasps> Go get your ride and take her back to base. Yes, sir. What the? Yeah! Solid. Quick thinking. It's just a shame they blew up the other speeder. So you could have gotten back to the others. Oh, that's such a cool room. 
imagine just taking some random elevator in a building and you just end up in this room. <laughs> I'd be like, uh, I'm going back inside. <laughs> a small rebel force has penetrated the shield and landed on Endor. My son is with them. I have felt him. Great, but I have not. Well, Sidious, we have a connection that you don't. <laughs> There's two more Rex beaters back there. But I found this. It's all right. She's fine. What, Chewie? What is it, Chewie? <laughs> Come on, dude. It's just sitting there. Chewie, wait, wake up! <laughs> nice. Oh, R2's on it. Easy. Yeah, I mean, if you land badly, you could easily get hurt. Oh, you're surrounded by teddy bears. <laughs> Even Luke's surprised. Hey! Oh, don't. Oh, my head! <laughs> They're like, whoa! <laughs> but I do believe they think I am some sort of god. <laughs> you can see why it's amusing. It's like, really? You out of all people? <laughs> <laughs> I love the little horns. I almost feel like this would have been a great place to have the I have a bad feeling about this quote. I have a really bad feeling about this. Oh my goodness, I com I completely forgot. Are you serious? But it appears you are to be the main cause of the banquet in my honor. Chewie's like, this is BS. Tell them if they don't do as you wish. You become angry and use your magic. Just to tell them. You wait a soldier. Boom! <laughs> Come on, they'd have to listen, right? They need proof of his power. <laughs> I love that he can just use the force on command whenever he wants now. Never knew I had it in me. Oh my goodness, go on, dude. Run. Oh gosh. <laughs> I love how uncomfortable Han Solo just looks. Han Solo? Han Solo is way out of his element. He's like, I got the love of my life on my left, and I got a little baby bear on my right. <laughs> what is happening? We need some fresh supplies, too. Try and get our weapons back. Hurry up, will you? I haven't got all day. He's trying. As long as I stay, I'm endangering the group and our mission. He's my father. If I don't make it back, you're the only hope of your life. I mean, she already is, though. B besides the fact that they're connected in this way, like, she's already the general. That power, too. In time, you'll learn to use it as I have. I want to see a Leia spin-off. Father has it. I have it. My sister has it. You gotta wink so that she knows what you're talking about. Like a little, like, my sister has it. <laughs> I've always I known, especially when I was trying to make Han jealous by kissing you. He won't turn me over to the Emperor. I can save him. I can turn him back to the good side. I'm watching a lot of movies lately where the protagonist is trying to spare the the villain as as much as they can. Like, I just watched How to Train Your Dragon 2, where he tries to make peace. What's going on? Nothing. I can't tell. Could you tell Luke? Is that who you could tell? Yeah, man. Let go of your, uh, your jealousy. Just be there for... I'm sorry. Hmm. Ah, poor Leia. That'd be such a crazy revelation. She's literally just found out that her father was the one who blew up her entire home planet. This is a rebel that surrendered to us. He was armed only with this. That's all he needs. So, you have accepted the truth. I've accepted the truth that you were once Anakin Skywalker. I know there is good in you. The Emperor hasn't driven it from me fully. He's straight to the point, hey. Doesn't muck around. I see you have constructed a new lightsaber. And it's green. Such a cool color. I must obey my master. I will not turn. If that is your destiny. You can't do this. I feel the conflict within you. Let go of your hate. It is too late for me. Aww. 
That's like the most honest he's been with him. He's literally admitting to him that he doesn't actually want to be who he is right now. He doesn't want to be Darth Vader. That's why I think when he said, you don't understand the power of the dark side, I think maybe it was less of a, um, oh, if you knew the power of the dark side, you turn. It's more like a, you don't understand how powerful Palpatine is. Like, we're both in danger. So I can't, I can't turn away from him. Proceed with the countdown. All right, let's go, rebels. <laughs> That's so cool. It's only a few guards. This shouldn't be too much trouble. Well, it only takes one to sound the alarm. I'm afraid our furry companion has gone and done something rather rash. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> I love that. <laughs> Here. Leia looks so happy then. <laughs> Look at this little guy go. <laughs> His friends will never believe him. Hey! <laughs> oh. <laughs> what a plan. <laughs> the height difference. It'd be so cool if we got like a, a Marvel's what if, but for Star Wars. And these two pair up and fight Palpatine. I'm looking forward to completing oh. your training. <laughs> he looks so gross. You will find that it is you who are mistaken <laughs> about a great many things. Now you must know your father can never be turned from the dark side. Your overconfidence is your weakness. Your faith in your friends is yours. Dang, he came quick with that counter. <laughs> Even when Luke was like, your arrogance is your weakness. And Vader was just like, whoa, <laughs> bro. It was I who allowed the Alliance to know the location of the shield generator. I'm afraid the deflector shield will be quite operational when your friends arrive. So I imagine uh, maybe Palpatine set this all up because he just wanted to get rid of the Rebel Alliance once and for all. He just wanted them all to be in the one place. Come back! They're gonna go oh, get some help. Stay with me! <laughs> <laughs> he literally jumped into it and then threw himself back off the railing. May the force be with us. I love that the rebels believe in the force. I mean, you'd expect them to, right? After everything they've seen with Luke. Take a base of action. We have enemy ships in sector 47. It's a trap! <laughs> there it is. It's a trap! Here you will witness the final destruction of the Alliance in significant rebellion. I oh, know, man. It's been causing you some trouble. <laughs> you want this, don't you? Well, yeah, it's a lightsaber. It makes bright, flashy sounds and noises. <laughs> All right, move it. Hey, over there. Where are you looking for me? <laughs> No, but thank you for showing up. <laughs> we surrender. Ah, attack of the teddies. <laughs> Mate, if I was a stormtrooper, I wouldn't know if this is horrifying or adorable. <laughs> I feel like the only thing that's sort of actually doing any damage are those big machines. Dang. Yeah, no, you're dead. It felt like that. Solid. Oh, poor little guy. He tried. We need R2. We need you at the bunker right away. This is no time for heroics. This is exactly the time for heroics. We're literally in the final fight. <laughs> Pressure steady. These sort of space battles, you'd get so dizzy, I feel like, just because you don't have, like, any sort of center of gravity. You're just moving around everywhere. I have my orders from the Emperor himself. He has something special planned for me. He has a special plan. Sounds like a surprise. Your friends have failed. He's just rubbing it in constantly. Fire. Dang, just like that. <laughs> that thing is operational. That thing's operational. <laughs> 
I bet Han's liking those teddy bears now. <laughs> I know they're called Ewoks. I just really like calling them teddy bears. <laughs> ah, dang it. The one robot you needed to, to get through the door. Was oh, it saying mama? Oh, I swear, if that's its mum. Your fleet is lost. Oh, stop, dude. I guess he is trying to get him to turn to the dark side. He's just trying to fill him with hate. Hmm. Chill, Luke. Esther. Have a tea or something. Just chill out. One. <laughs> Dang it. It's frustrating because he didn't actually kill him, but he still kind of committed the act of trying to murder him, which is against the Jedi way. I mean, Yoda was trying to kill him, right? Dang. Savages. Oh, solid. That's right. I forgot that Chewie was in that other one. Literally, that's all you need to do to win this battle. It's just to hijack one of those things. I think I got it. I got it. No, you don't got it. <laughs> Solid. Stay back. You see a little feet tuck back. Chewie's like, I just beat the entire Empire army. <laughs> Dang, just like that. Fighting. Hey. I mean, yeah, Darth Vader's got more like brawn and force ability, but Luke's agile. He got that dexterity stats. Well, that's terrifying. <laughs> you can't even see his expression. That's so freaky. Unwise to lower your defenses. Vader's putting on his A game. <laughs> Obi Wan has taught you well. Great gymnast instructor. You will meet your destiny. <laughs> Far out. They're fleeing into the woods. To continue the pursuit. Three to help. It's such a shame. They look so happy. They're like, yes, we beat them. Oh, yes. Let's just run past the dead bodies out into the open. <laughs> Finally. What should have been done 30 minutes ago. <laughs> Got a little bit distracted there with a big fight. <laughs> you cannot hide forever. This is how I felt when I was hiding with snacks under the couch in the middle of the night when my dad was trying to find me. <laughs> me just munching like... Your feelings for them are strong, especially for... <laughs> the fact that he knows she's a twin as well. If you will not turn to the dark side, then perhaps she will. <laughs> Yikes. Far out. That's all he needed to be full of hate. Threat against his sister. Once again, his love is what's creating his hate. Far out, dude. Dang. Bruh. I mean, you can't deny the fact that rage is... Oh, gosh. Fulfill your destiny and take your father's place. Yeah, look at that, mate. You're becoming your father. I'll never turn to the dark side. Yes. You failed, your highness. <laughs> I am a Jedi. Yeah. Like my father before me. Let's go, mate. Oh, he's mad. Because even if he can beat him just on power alone, like, Luke beat him. Like, he lost. Oh, well. There goes the generator. Now he can finally destroy the Death Star. Go, group. All fighters follow me. <laughs> Told you they'd do it. <laughs> <laughs> yep. A hundred rebel deaths later. <laughs> you will be destroyed. <laughs> Should have seen this coming, man. I mean, hasn't no one's seen Force Lightning ever, I reckon, alive at the moment. 
bro, don't fall down the chasm. <laughs> your lack of vision. Mate, that is so painful. You will die. Oh, he's so evil. Come on, man. The love of the father is coming through. No. No. Yeet. Bye. And that is the end of Palpatine forever. It's so poetic. I mean, like, he turned to the dark side out of love, but he turned to the light side of the force out of love as well. Goes nothing. Yeah, you gotta have really good pilots to be able to go through here. <laughs> Straight into the bridge. Ah, oh, far out. Look at Luke, still trying to save his father. Let me look on you with my own eyes. Yeah, because he's looking through some artificial sort of like lenses or something. Hey. Skywalker. Hmm. Oh, he looks so happy to see his son. Leave me. I'll not leave you here. I've got to save you. You already have. You are right about me. These final moments are so meaningful. I won't leave you. Oh, poor Luke. It's almost like, yeah, the suit was keeping him alive, but I wonder if it was just painful for him just being alive, being Darth Vader. It was just so exhausting. Hey, you better get out of there, mate. Go, 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 go. Move the fleet. There's that one stormtrooper flying behind them going like, oh man, I failed. <laughs> Yeah, that wasn't close at all. Far out. Go, 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 go. Yeah. <laughs> that would feel so good. Nice. Yeah, you won. I'm sure Luke wasn't on that thing when it blew. I can see that. You loved him. Yeah. Oh, come on. Use your intuition. He's a man. Tell him you're not interested. He needs to know. <laughs> My brother. Oh, man, he'd be so happy. He's like, yes, I don't have competition anymore. <laughs> Let's burn him to death properly this time. <laughs> It's all up to you now, Luke. You're the future. Mate, the parties after the Empire is gone would have been crazy. All the Gungans and the Naboo people. Ah, uh, Coruscant. Oh, the parties on Coruscant would be wild. <laughs> the statue of Palpatine coming down too. It's kind of crazy how many people are partying even on Coruscant. You're kind of like, were they really like that oppressed on Coruscant. I imagine that a lot of the people on Coruscant would have just been like, submissive, you know? <laughs> That's actually kind of morbid, using the helmets of dead troopers as <laughs> drums. <laughs> Mate, what a feeling though, hey. On the run, going into battles for like the last few years, and it's like it finally defeated the Empire. There's our boy, Hayden Christensen. <laughs> oh, I bet they're so proud. Okie dokie, so that was Return of the Jedi. Honestly, 
like just after watching that it makes me really excited to watch the first like the prequels now i just feel like i want to keep that train going but we'll have a little bit of a break but i i really love return of the jedi i really like it particularly because of the they, the, the relationship between vader and luke i really love the way that they highlight just the power of the whole point is kind of like it's not about power it's kind of like the connection that luke and vader have and the, the love between a father and son that kind of breaks that cycle of um lust for power and i just really love the way that it's it's so poetic the way that they decided to make them overthrow palpatine was really with their love for each other father and son um the only criticism i really have against this movie is i just feel like the pacing is a little slow that's all i just feel like when i watch new hope and the empire strikes back it just feels a lot more like fast paced and i really like that um this movie was like two hours and 15 minutes um so yeah i felt like the first act is normally slow at jabba's palace but you know that's just me like um it's the only real criticism i have against the movie i feel like everything else is great i still had fun i had a great time anyway i really hope you guys enjoyed yourselves i really did please like and subscribe and i will see you all next time